Hey guys, it's Lewis here from Barefoot and today I am going to be showing you how you can use private browsing on any iOS device even if sometimes it's blocked. So if you go on Safari, usually about here next to the plus just to the left there will be a sign saying private browsing. But we don't have that. But I'm showing you how you can get private browsing without that button but before we get into the video please smash that like button if you enjoyed this video and it helped you and subscribe for more tech and science related videos now this is very simple to open a private tab all you have to do is hold this button here so next to the plus are these two little squares now if you open the touch it normally it comes to this place and usually there'll be the private browsing button up here if that's not the case, you just hold it down and you can do new private tab. Now you are private browsing and it's pretty cool. You can do whatever you want with the private browsing. It's just normal browsing but on private. So really easy. Hold these two squares. Private browsing. If you close the tab, it won't. But basically, that's how you get private browsing. Now to get rid of it, you just have to home button, double tap, swipe up Safari. Reopen it and it will come back to a normal. So if you're searching, I don't know, let's look on I fix it. Then let's go to new private tab and then I fix it. Then you double tap, swipe up. You can see it's gone back to that I fix it tab. Yeah, but that's pretty much it. It's quite a short video, but quite easy method isn't it so like i said at the beginning please subscribe for more videos and leave a like if this video was helpful to you that's it from me today goodbye